So this morning I made some homemade biscuits and then I turned those into some yummy ham, or I guess Canadian bacon, egg and cheese biscuit sandwiches. And I'll put a couple of these in the refrigerator and then I'll wrap the rest of them up and put them in the freezer for later. I am so late at getting my garlic in this year, but my motto is better late than never. So here I am on December 6th, planting my garlic. So the other day I cleared out this bed from the summer that had lettuce in it that I just let bolt. And I was preparing it for this purpose. I was waiting for this bag of soil here to arrive and it got here yesterday. So what I've done here, this dusting on the top here is wood ash from our fireplace and homemade bone meal. And then I'm just gonna top it off with some new uh, potting soil before I plant these garlic. So here's what I ended up with. I planted three different varieties, well, two different varieties of garlic and one leek, I suppose. Um, and I've never planted these before. This is 62 uh, Vietnamese hard neck garlic here. And then over on this end is 103 ish <laughs> of the Nootka soft neck garlic. And then here, I'm not sure if you can see, but there's one, two, and three. Those are elephant garlic, which is actually a leek, but I got a bunch of those and I decided to throw three of them in this bed to see how they do. And the final touch for today is a nice layer of leaves over the top just to insulate them a little bit, hold in any moisture that we get, and hopefully prevent any weeds from coming through later as well. So I am back in the house now, getting warmed back up. It's quite chilly outside, um, and that was where I'm stopping for today. Now, to those beds, what I still want to do is I had purchased last year a drip irrigation system from Haas Tools for raised beds, and I put those in my front raised beds, my four front raised beds, but I have a lot of tubing left over. And so I'm going to run irrigation tubing into those two side gardens. I just need to get more of the connectors and then one more of the, like at the beginning of the system where you hook your hose in, I have to get a new one of those um, so that I can actually make it a functioning irrigation system, but I can wait for that until next year or in the spring or later on if I have time, which I highly doubt. <laughs> um, but this is where I'm going to be ending for today. Um, I may be at making some cookies today, but highly unlikely. I need to make some cookies I've never made freezer cookies, but I think I want to try making those just to have like ready-made cookies on hand. That would be nice. Uh, but that's on the to-do list and I don't think that'll be happening today. I still need to figure out what I'm doing for dinner tonight. So I will catch you guys tomorrow. Thank you guys for stopping by today and joining in on our journey here at Bourbon's Living. We'll catch you on the next one.